<sighs> What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Mr. Cheap Sense, back once again. And I had this package. I just got it in when I got home about 4.30. And it is a little after 5 right now. And I didn't want to add this to the video I just did about the Polo Blue Gold Blend. Uh, this is a package from a subscriber, Harold Lee Jr., and the young lady at the desk downstairs told me I had a package, and I picked it up, and that does not sound good. I haven't even opened it yet. The box is not wet, but it does look like something fell on top of it. And I know it's probably going to be hard to see. You can see this line right here. And on the back side, there's another line right here. It looks like something fell on top of it. Hopefully, it's not broken. It's probably just some other stuff he may have put in the box. But I got my fingers crossed. So let's get into it. I swear I hope this is not broken because I've had to deal with this one time before and it's sad man that the postal service doesn't take care of people's belongings it's it's really sad I don't think it's broken. It just sounds like some stuff is just rattling around because the, the paper is not even wet. Let's see. What do we have? Oh, wow. Okay. Now, I already had an idea of what was coming because we already talked about it. But he also stuck in some, some other things. The main thing that, that I knew was coming, and which I didn't expect, this other one. And I'm excited about it because... I never thought I would have any of these fragrances. I know how expensive they are. I never thought I would. And I just put the, the atomizer back on this bottle. And the smell that is in here is tantalizing. Jesus. All right. So I'm going to get into the little stuff first. He sent Creed. Millicene Imperial. And it's. It looks like one of those little dabbers. I don't like dabbers, but I am still appreciative of what he sent because he didn't have to. And I even told him uh, when he offered, I didn't ask. I didn't have my hand out. I didn't beg anybody for anything. Um, he said he was going to send me his bottle because he doesn't wear it. He doesn't really care for it that much. And he was offering to gift it to me. And I said, hey, man, you don't have to do that. I appreciate it. And he said, okay, so for the people or person out there who's saying I got my hand out or I'm begging people for stuff, that's a bunch of bull. My subscribers are the ones who offer to send me things. I ask nobody for nothing. So if somebody out the generosity of their heart wants to send me something, I'm not going to turn it down. So if they choose to turn it down, that's their thing. I don't care about all that. I'm beyond all that foolishness. But Millicene Imperial by Creed. He sent Oud Bourbon by Byron Parfums. And I think I've heard of this fragrance house before. He sent... What is this? Um, Mason Francis Kirk John. This is. I can't 
can't even read what it says. Gentle fluidity is what it's called. Okay. The next one is... I can't even read what this one says. It, it says intense on the label, but I can't read what it says on the other side. So I'm not sure what that is, but maybe I can get him to, if he sees this video, he'll either leave it in the comment section or message me and let me know. Uh, this one is Joe Malone. London, what is this, Oud and Bergamot, and last but not least when it comes to these, we have Sarah Baker Parfums, this is Jungle Jezebel, and he also threw in something that I have already fallen in love with because the atomizer, like I said, I pulled it off, pulling it out the bag. And <clears throat> the smell is so intoxicating that I got from it. It is from the house of Montal, Paris. This is Oud Amazing. And it feels like I can't see through it, but it feels like it's a pretty decent amount still and it's maybe maybe right in here it might be a little bit less but i love the smell of this Ooh, amazing that is crazy it's got my room lit up and the one that i did a video on the other day and he saw it and i guess he didn't care for this one too much i actually like it um, it is Hindu Kush from Mansara. So now I have two. Well, I have a Mansara and I have a Montal, I should say. Ood Amazing. And Hindu Kush from Mansara. And it is the screw cap, which I like. Hindu Kush. Let me. I don't want to get it on me because I got on that polo, polo blue gold blend. Yep, that's it. That is Hindu Kush, and that's a nice bottle. For this to be a such a small bottle, it's got some weight to it. It is heavy. It is very heavy. That is a strong smell. I like this, man. I like this a lot. And it's damn. If it's not a full bottle, it's damn near full. That's crazy. Thank you, man. Thank you again. I, I really do appreciate it. Like I say, man, I have some of the best subscribers. Um, they just keep amazing me. Ooh, amazing. I've heard some things about this fragrance. Um, just never got my nose on it, I don't think. But now that I have it, it will be getting some wearings. Um, it actually smells more of like a cooler weather scent. Ooh, amazing. Uh, but, you know, who knows? One of these cool nights, if it's still cool in the spring, um, I may be able to get a wearing out of it just to see what it does. Um, but, like I said, man, thank you, thank you, thank you for this. I was very, very skeptical when I got that box and I shook it around a little bit, I was like, that don't sound right. But it was just these little ones inside rattling around. So um, once again, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, Harold Lee Jr. for this. That is a very kind gesture. I, I didn't expect you to send that Montal. I just knew the Hindu Kush was coming and I knew you said you was going to throw in you know a few other things um which i'm a, i'm very intrigued about some of these fragrances that you sent um i have heard some of these names 
before, but I've never really got my nose on any of those fragrances. Uh, so I can't wait to get into those. And if you know what this one is that you sent, and it says intense, but I can't tell what it's supposed to be. Let me see if I can smell it and tell. I really don't want to waste a spray, but I don't know. Whatever that is, it smells nice, though. That is nice. Very nice. All right. So I have played around long enough. I need to get out of here because I got some floors to wax tonight. Um, well, I'm trying to finish up anyway, but um, thank you once again for this gracious, these gracious gifts. Um, I appreciate it. And I'm out of here, y'all. Hey, here is to smelling great. I'm out, y'all. Peace. Smile on my face, man. Thank you.